Hi, everybody. I should be here. Um, was just having some issues with dropping frames. Connection issue. Something somewhere. So we'll see what happens here. Uh, if it's noticeable, if it's a really a big problem. But hopefully it shouldn't be. And, of course, I do record the stream, so I should be able to put this up on YouTube without any issues at that point. Anyway, hello Azure Dreamer, and hello everybody. Hope everyone's having a lovely weekend here. Hello Kira. Let's go ahead and just cross your fingers, hope for the best here. We're gonna start a new game. Somebody was very, very kind and gave this to me as a birthday present. I mentioned that I wanted it, that I had an interest in it, and they gave it to me. So I don't know if I should share their name or not. I figure if they want to, they will let themselves be known. But thank you, Anonymous Benefactor. And hello, Truth Exile. Hello, everybody. Kira, you may or may not have seen this game before. I watch the same people you do. And those people have played this. And, oh, you've played it too? Yeah, I, from what I had seen of it, it looked very cute, very fun. And I thought it would be nice to do on stream. Good morning, and welcome to yet another day of space adventure. You are only five light years away from your destination, home. The fuel tank is full and the ship is flying at full speed. Today's to-do list contains waking up and touching the All right. I didn't see anything for subtitles. Are there subtitles? I thought it might have just been a given. Oh, okay. Alright. Just wanted to double check that, because I looked and I didn't see a subtitles thing being in the options. And then it starts off and there's somebody talking. All right. Got some things to look at here. Um. Oh. Okay, so that's just a sit. Sit there. Oh, I got a jemmy. Jemmy thing. I got a ball. And I lost the ball. There it is. Eh. I can't get the ball. camera. Uh, I need to change the camera. Oh, you can't change the camera. Oh, okay. Inverts are here. There we are. This is really close up. I might change that later as well. Sorry, there's some some things I thought I was set on, then other ones you don't know until you start playing. To 
disable depth of field. I can try that as soon as I find that. I guess it would be in here. Yeah, because sometimes the camera... Like, inverted on the Y-axis is usually always the same, but some... Everybody has a different interpretation on if it's going to be... Uh, like, left... what if Which direction the camera's going to turn when you move left on the, on the stick. I don't see depth of field. Unless I... Able to... change that to far. How about that? I don't see any specific depth of field thing, though. Alright, moving on. <laughs> well, to me, for the up and down, standard is... If you move the stick up, the camera goes up. If you move it down, camera goes down. And inverted is opposite of that. Like, um... Like flying a jet or something. <laughs> and that's how I like to do that, but... That's just another thing that you sit at for no reason. Hello, Roomba. Alright, what is this that we're looking at? Presents? Gems? We got one. Probably don't need that yet. Oh, oh, wait, what was... What am I, do what am I doing? Oh, oh, I got, like... I hurt myself on it. Alright. Mind me just playing around with everything. Hello, TGP, TGB Nikki. Good to see you. We're just getting a feel for the controls here. That's the whole point of this area. Oh, we got a little... Too close. <laughs> There's stuff in here, but nothing that I can interact with. Boop the big screen, alright. We'll get there eventually. I'm not noticing any dropping of frames or anything anymore, so that's good. I booped the Roomba. Looks like we're on our way home. I imagine things are going to go bad. There's no no booping of the screen. There we are. I'm on the Roomba. Oh! Achievement! <laughs> Ride the vacuum. Is that... That didn't come up on screen, though. Okay. Uh, 
All right, here's somebody who's knocking at that door. Let's let's ignore them for a moment and just. All right, some more fun little views there. What is this flying boat? A mafia Long boats man. need to be tall in Mafia Town, even in space. Mafia come in to collect. <laughs> okay, this is a cute thing. Oh no, all of our time fuel. Welcome to Mafia Town. Guess it's loading. There we go. Okay, nothing to do with him. This camera really needs to stop being so far up in my character. Let's try very far. Maybe because we're in a tight space that it's it's being like this, but oof. I will, I will. I'm just ex I'm, I'm checking things out, seeing what I got. Oh, okay. Couldn't cut her off. Okay, what is, do I have an attack besides this? There we are. Mafia Vault Code. Okay, we can't climb trees like in the Mario. Alright, so those lines are... showing me where the things are. And then what's this over here? Oh, I did a thing. Got him. All roads lead to mafia. Not good. Big immigration problems. We fix this by moving to island. Now no road lead to mafia. We did get the three. Sprint yarn. Requires two yarn to... Okay. I'm sure that will make a little more sense as we go further along. I assume this is just straight up life. Yeah, alright. For now, let's just continue chasing after the girl. And then we can do more exploration after that. Today I punch Beru dressed as old lady. It makes people scared of Mafia. Hi Darcy, how are you doing tonight? Life of Mafia is good. Oh, 
Oh, oh. Okay, game. Be that way. Uh, so far, it is a pretty cool game. It's got a lot of charm to it. We just started it. Hey you! Down there! Don't think I didn't see you stalking me! <sighs> if I had a dollar for every time I heard a girl tell me that. Us kids should stick together, not stalk one another. I mean, Mafia Town can be a really dangerous place. So what do you say? Wanna join my little rebellion? Sure. Oh, by the way, did you have anything to do with the junk falling from the sky? Yeah? Yikes. Looks like you've got a lot of cleaning up to do, huh? Tell you what, come up here and I can show you where some of your junk landed. pieces fell and smashed right into the market's fountain. Messed it up real good. When going over there, just avoid making eye contact with the Mafia and you'll be fine. Good luck, fellow rebel. See ya! In COD we trust. Okay, now we got a weapon, like an actual weapon. Thank you. All right, there we are. Just got to get through this little tutorial bit, huh? So save the exploration until after we we no longer have our hand held, right? Rift ponds? I'm not sure what that means. Hey Burzmali, how are you doing tonight? All right, all right. Uh-oh, the little mustache girl got caught. Try that again. All right, it's exactly how it looks. Just jump up, up against the wall, and you run, and then you can jump off. Hmm. 
talk to him, but I ended up not doing that. Now we are starting to understand some things. Level collectibles, equipment. That bumper to swamp hats. Oh, no, I'm gonna get... At least I can get revenge on him this time. Oh, or not. Let's take it out on his friend. to no longer have it direct me with the camera, I guess. I'll figure that out later. Seem... Can't have child weakness when Mafia teaching lesson. <laughs> child witness. <laughs> oh, it's awkward for Mafia. Mafia not sure what to do. Boss, what do we do with eyewitness? Teach her lesson, boys. Starting to lag. Yeah, okay, I see the things. Yeah, there's something going on with the connection to Twitch where I'm dropping some frames here and there. Mafia won't bow to little girl. Don't think there's anything Prepare I can do on my end. Mafia's I tested my connection. Wrath. And everything seemed fine, and choosing another server would just there's no other servers that are close by that would really work for connecting to. Stand still! All right, we want him to hit things. Do not think about avoiding perils. Heads up, little punk. Oh. See if girl can handle this peril. Is this just a waiting game, or am I looking for something? 
specific for these barrels to hit. This lead nowhere. All right, waiting. Mafia game. need to take care of this mafia style. Prepare to feel what mafia do to old ladies. Oh, child is ridiculous. How did you? You can jump. How did you? Everything gets so freaking blurry. I guess to discourage you from running away from the timepiece. Can you believe them? What a bunch of losers! Hey, you're all right, new kid. Do you have a name? No? You shy? That's cool. You're a less talk, more fighting kind of girl, I take it. That thing you grabbed there. Are you collecting them? Because I know where there's more of them. They've been raining from the sky ever since you arrived. I've seen the goons bring them to their headquarters way up there. We should go up there and get your junk! It'll be fun! I'll take any opportunity that involves messing up the Mafia! You with me, buddy? Mustache girl! <laughs> oh, we have an affection rating. So now we are friends with Mustache Girl. That's her actual freaking name. I want to check. Okay, do the gems do anything in particular, or is it just collecting them for the sake of collecting them, and then maybe something will happen eventually? Are you ready to take down some mafia? Let's do it! I'm psyched! Let's go over the plan. <laughs> Assaults need a good plan, or it'll be a flop. First, we strangle them, choke them, and watch them beg for mercy. That'll show them. No, wait. Strangling is too kind. We smash them together into mush and put their remains in a jar. That sounds like a good plan. Then, we sell the jar for pocket money. That'll be the ultimate salt in the wound. <laughs> What if that's what this game was? Like, just actually mutilating Mafia into little puddles of blood and gore and then selling the jars? <clears throat> but first, we have to uh, make it through their Mafia HQ. Once we find and dethrone the Mafia boss, the rest will follow. Then our mush and jar party will be no problem! We've got to get you geared up. Your hat is basic. And we don't do basic in this gang. Yarn can be found around Mafia Town and used to stitch new hats if you're crafty. I've collected one for you. Yay for yarn. You need more yarn for some hats than others. I guess being creative isn't free. <laughs> so keep an eye out for yarn. Now you're a killing machine. Let's go get them. <laughs> or is there any purpose in going back to previous levels to maybe find more gems or, or yarn or anything? Or should I just keep moving forward? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Alright, 
let's go ahead and... <laughs> okay, I really like the art in this game. Oh, that's adorable. We got a little raincoat. Little girlsy thing over there? Mafia wonder if there is way to get but Mafia no time to search for entrance if Mafia need to stare. Okay, so the other hat... This one will let me get directed towards my objective. Alright, we're learning. Probably need to get high enough up. Or we could just sit in this chair. Alright, the camera's not doing me many favors. I keep jumping too far. Get that yet? All right. We've got some other little things going over there. I'm going to assume water's bad. Oh no, I can survive the water. How about that? for things I already got. So yeah, this is a snowflake icon. Just like the other one. So I guess I need a special power that I'm going to get eventually. Child is predictable. That's... Probably get something later to deal with those too. to family. I take everything now. <laughs> family beg for Mafia not to take everything. Mafia say it is joke. Mafia funny. But real <laughs> joke is Mafia take everything <laughs> anyway. Uh, did I get the DLC? I don't actually know. This was gifted to me and it may have just been the base game. Oh dear. Oh god. Oh, it's just like in the picture. Mafia not cool. Mafia give good replacement for old family home. Small raft on sea. Is close to water. Has good view. Not even need to go to market when fish below. Oh, now he's scared of me? Okay. Alright, we are learning. 
How about that you? That darn seagull over there took my camera. But your camera's no. That's your camera, right there, on you. I would have gone and done a belly dive over there. No, but this belly's too precious for sliding on. I'm sorry, what am I seeing up there? Okay, this camera can... Okay, oh, it dropped. What are you? What the... Are you a... You are a raccoon who is dreaming and your snot bubble is making you float. <laughs> and I killed it. Good job, me. Alright, we can't do that yet. Can make the jump. Oh, hello to you, Redo Mexican. You're having a lovely night. Well, for starters, let's just go try to find. Am I this? Why did the mud do this? I'm doing all right. I'm a little tired. I get tired around this time, but I'm starting to get my second wind. We got quite a few things to find if we go running around looking for them. Well, why is there so much sprint yarn? I only needed the two, and I got the two. it keeps saying specifically for like the sprint hat so yarn is just universal once I get like the blueprint or what have you
falling further and further down. No longer a scary mud monster. Works for me. I feel like I'm doing something wrong with this camera. I should have enough. Yeah, enough to stitch hat. Gotcha. Cook up mad concoct. Oh boy. So we have like Molotovs. <laughs> I guess I needed to be mud. Mafia's covered in mud. Mafia knew all along. Mafia is being invaded by aliens. Ah! <laughs> oh, well. It's actually a thing to... Okay, it is. It's an actual sort of platform. What? Okay, didn't realize that was the edge. And... Alright. Just gotta get used to this. Hey, Green Puggy. You're a little late, but we'll forgive you this one time. All you've really missed is me just getting used to the controls, or trying and failing to get used to the controls. This... My... Maybe I don't want the camera inverted. Yeah, because there really is no looking up and down with the camera. It's just zooming in and out. So I think this is what I want. Right? Hopefully, maybe. I gotta remember to cancel that dive like it's telling me to do. Because if I don't, then I keep sliding.
Hey, Yamato. Wow, everybody's here tonight. Hi. Leave Mafia alone, you monster. Hope everybody's here, doing Mafia great. Will you, this, <laughs> will you go away? Oh, thank you very much for the sub. You weren't lying when you said that Twitch Prime was renewing. <laughs> thank you very much. Everybody, tell Green Puggy thank you. So we got four. That opened... No? Or no, I only have three. That was my bad. So it tells you about the timepiece, but other things like yarn and stuff, it doesn't tell you if you got everything or not. <laughs> One less soon. Looks like we might be dealing with some kind of boss fight. Well, Twitch Prime is free if you have Amazon Prime, and but the subscriptions, you only get the one free one to give out to somebody, and you chose to give it, give it to me, so I appreciate that. that I should be using, or am I just gonna go guns blazing in here? Good job, kid. Guns blazing it is. Doesn't seem like I could follow her that way. Oh, okay. Two buttons, one for each of us. I couldn't tell you what achievements there are and aren't. Yeah, it seems like we both needed to be on the, the buttons there. Oh, very nice. You were talking about working together with a friend of yours. So did you guys get something together for that band? Oh, oh you're going to throw things at me? You. Thank you. Hi there, young one. I am from a far away land. I've seen every corner of the earth, and now I sell tiny pieces of my discoveries. That's some kind of glitch alien. You may call me the badge seller, for I sell and trade badges. I can provide you with strong abilities and upgrades to your hat. If you have money, of course. So this is what I needed the gems for. Just a little bit short of being able to get all of them. Yeah. 
<laughs> Shame. And then we'll come back real soon for that last one. So this is equipped. Yes. Yes, it certainly is. Badges are. I want. <laughs> this is a pretty cute game. And now that should also be. Yeah, alright. Oh, slot machines. No. We're at a casino. Why'd they be arcade machines? I just... I got games on the mind. What is... Oh, okay. Uh, Alright, we're not going to get through that at this point in time. We're going to need something else. He's blocking the theater. We're not going to get past him. We have to go up in order to... Or we could just stop and get a drink. Mafia not know what child drink. Whatever problem is, Mafia sure you can deal with it. You look like tenacious type. Not leave problem alone. Other little girl run into kitchen if you are looking for her. <laughs> she look like unruly type. Keep eye on her. Well, he's very friendly. I I very much love the little squeaky noises when I hit things that I'm not supposed to be able to hit. I don't know if they're necessarily not bad or if they're just not smart. Go ahead, kid. Open this thing up and I'll keep guard here. Okay. So we need that key. Go ahead, kid. Think about this then. Buckets of crabs. The mafia terrible and a cat at chef. cooking, but fear not. Cooking cat is here. Okay, this has the best characters ever in any game. I'll prepare the actual dinner up here and swap the food before anybody eats the mafia's cooking. Certain someone would die if they ate the mafia prepared food. That seems to be a pretty deliberate hint there. Especially since I can pick up buckets of crab.
actually... Well, we'll see. But for right now... Do that. We'll see if I need those crabs for anything else, or the mafia food for anything else. I wonder if Cooking Cat has any relation to Cool Cat. Does he also save kids? Stop bullying? So it's these barrels that I'm able to... Alright. And there's a the yarn for my trouble. Another recipe, though. Anything that's like glowy that looks like it can be blown up. Oh, well, that's. Ch oh! So, it is you! Ever since you landed in Mafia Town, it's been raining with these magical hourglasses. You must be very lost, kid with the hat. You're in the heart of our town, standing before the most powerful man you will ever witness. Everything you've ever owned belongs to me now, including this hourglass piece. If you want it, We'll have to settle it in true Mafia style! Fight! Action! It is showtime! Side-scrolling type of battle. Can I just say I love the little Mafia guys as trees? in this play. Nice variety for just one boss fight. I get your brain captured, and soon you will both perish. Bravo! Go with me, psycho! Mafia ball! <laughs> um. Yes, I, I just figured that out. Thank you. I 
put two and two together. Sometimes you just gotta think. I'm I'm kind of here, hold on. Just like you said, Azure Dreamer. I figured it out. Wait, why'd you do that? What? So what do these things do anyway? Are they some sort of rare collector's item for nerds? <laughs> Now you fucked up. Whoa! What? Well, did um, did you know about this? This is crazy. Do you even realize what could be done with these? We can make it so that you never got punched in the face by the mafia that one time. <laughs> All right, you have yourself a good night, Green Puggy. And thank you again for the sub. No, wait. Uh, we can make it so the Mafia never arrived on the island. Wait, wait, wait. Even better. We could be crime fighting time travelers. Wait. What? This doesn't make any sense. You have all this power, and you're not gonna use it to fight evil? If you're not gonna use them to fight evil, well, we just then made an a new enemy, right? Yeah. I'm not gonna let this island remain as Mafia Town. Collect all the time pieces for myself. You have my word on it. <laughs> Good thing I spent a whole bunch of them. Oh, boy. This game is oozing with style, and I love it for it. So we unlock different areas to get to new levels. Just like in Super Mario 64. I don't think I have tokens. I don't know where I would get tokens, but we will figure that out eventually, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. 
time rift detected? Alright, I assume this I need a hundred gems to access. By the way, that's yeah, to unlock it. We can go back here, get another timepiece, or we could do Time Rift Blue. Let's try this. Or... Oh. So I need to find the spot in the picture and get that Time Rift. And I'm assuming... There's a connection between this and this. Those are aiming down, and the other one is aiming up. Up-ish. Just gotta find a good way to get up there. If I stand real close to these when I throw this... Alright, does not hurt me. Good. That does, though. So I don't know how to get higher up just yet. Maybe I don't actually have to get higher up.
that sucked. So that's not a thing. At least not for that. But I am seeing... Possibly... Alright, not here, then somewhere nearby. I feel like I am fighting this camera so dang hard, though. That's... My only real complaint so far is just the camera. My... A bunch of people here have played this, apparently. Am I the only one who feels that? Okay, this is like Mario... Oh, definitely like Mario Sunshine. Got little platforming challenges. See, like, I, I want to just want the camera to just stay. Stay put while I run straight. St mm -hmm. It wants to get behind you. So I'm walking like this. Alright, now that time it... But like this... It keeps, keeps turning on its own. That's not good. Just let it be what it is, game. Come on. Oh! Okay. Thank you very much for that. Thank you. See, these are the things I don't know. No, I don't have assist mode on. Camera assist. There we go. Alright, so that's something I didn't think about. Thank you very much. That's, like, way better. Also, let, let me just take a moment to say how good this music is. There's some things I just don't think about. Especially when I get ready to start a new game, I do look at the options to make sure everything is set properly for streaming and stuff like that. But then there's certain things that I just won't know until I actually start playing how it's going to affect me. And it's entirely possible that I just forget about some of the things in that process. I appreciate the Mario Sunshine vibes here. Has it? Because I keep 
getting the number keeps going up for me on my end. In fact, as you said that, it just went up again. Okay. I don't think I was paying close enough attention to know what triggered that. I thought I just got a timepiece. But we have pretty new clothes. I'm down with that. moment to look at all this. This is cute. Oh, I like these. <laughs> Alright, so it's specifically for the roulettes. Thank you very much. Can I redo a level and get a new slot machine like that? Or are they just like one-offs? If it's just cosmetic things like the new colors, that's fine. If there is other things like special abilities and stuff, it might be a little more problem. There's nothing up here, right? This is just like a vantage point to look at things. Okay, there we are. Whoop! <laughs> they, like, move right out from under me. And I assume I have to break this. That's fine with me. Things that don't actually affect my ability to play better. This music gives me Legend of Zelda vibes. I can't remember, like, it's a specific section. Maybe the Zora Palace? I can't remember um, where the music is specifically in the game. Alright, I kill him and he comes back. I guess we'll find out if they're safe to jump on. And that was the answer all along.
Alright, with that camera assist off, it's feeling a little bit better. Oh, hat flare. Let's just go with that. Alright, we have a little flower for our hat now. That's good. We need one more to unlock the next area. That's just, we're gonna sit on that if I go to that. Let's go to the internet, everybody. And we're gonna surf the net. Oh, darn. Oh! Is this actually a thing, or is this just to goof off with? Let's search for what I always search for when I'm on the internet. Wait, hold on. <laughs> okay. <sighs> this is going to fit. I think it should. <laughs> Well, there was nothing wrong with that one. I really don't know, <laughs> know if there's anything to this. Go to the games. Oh, for crying out loud. Is this a, like a text adventure? <laughs> oh, my God. This, this is like a complete game here.
Let's let's leave it at that. Oh, okay. Yeah, I if that's a full on thing. My goodness. Dead Bird Studio. <laughs> so now we're trading Mafia for birds. is too big for the both of us, DJ. Grooves. The movie should be made by real birds. You moon penguins are just gonna write some loud, noisy dribble. If I wanted a bunch of picnics to dance around while on bird seed, ha, I'd visit my grandchildren. <laughs> nonsense, darling, nonsense. You owl express birds are just gonna record another boring train related western. You've done so for the last ten years, darling. What? No, we haven't, your buffoon! Conductor, darling, this year we'll be winning the annual Bird Movie Award, as our new movie props will bring in the audiences. These shiny things fell from the sky. They will light our movie sets and fill them with glimmer. Oh, yeah? Well, this time around, we're also spicing it up with our newest movie props. These hourglass thingies will be the grand jewel in our train heist western. The what? You no good, dirty picnics! You've copied our props! I would never, darling. Clearly, you're the one who took inspiration in my flashy new props. Oh, that does it! Get out of here with ya! I've got a movie to record! Fine by me, darling. But we'll be the ones who win the annual Bird Movie Award. Mark my word. Well, I guess we know where we're looking for our timepieces. Yeah. Let's see how well you do when you can't get into the reception. <laughs> oh, wait, uh... Shut my picnics inside the studio will force them to work harder. <laughs> All right, time to go, owls. Let's make our killer movie. Oh, and uh, receptionist, can you please close off that vent already? I don't want the smell of penguin to come anywhere near my crew. I wanted to ask this reception guy a question, but he hasn't acknowledged me at all. Uh, but now I've been standing here for so long, it'd be awkward to start up a conversation. I really suck at interacting with other birds. <laughs> oh, hey, little chirper. They're recording right now, so no one's allowed in. You're only insured for bird staff. Letting you in would be a liability. Don't even think about sneaking inside. I definitely appreciate that there's so much variety in what they are willing to do with the different characters here. Eh. 
Hey! Please, disregard my twitchy behavior. My body has been to places that have left a permanent mark. That doesn't seem like it'd be beneficial, and it might not actually be beneficial, but I'm gonna buy it one day. Gimme. Not that I can equip that right now, I don't believe. Huh? You want that movie prop they carried in? Are you the kind of person that sells movie props on eBird? Uh, hi there. I'm an express owl, which really just means I ride the Owl Express that the conductor runs. I need to ride the train to get to work, but the conductor makes unexpected stops all the time. I have no idea why we're at a movie studio. I need to be at work in 15 minutes. I don't really get this feud between the conductor and DJ Grooves. Like, why does a train operator and a disco guy want to compete? We're all birds here, right? Shouldn't we cooperate? I don't know. I guess cooperating is kind of stupid. I guess. Yeah. Just ignore me. Camera. Be polite. Well, we could go in here right now, but I want to explore the other side here first. Okay, I'm so glad I checked the other side. <laughs> Got little Blues Brothers penguins. And I got sunglasses. You see my fingers here? You see how they're snapping? That is the universal bird sign for beat it. Oh look, my fingers have taken a liking to you. Look at them go. Snap, snap, snap. You catch my drift? Hey, little girl, you should join our DJ Groove's fan club. You get a membership card and everything. It's a real good deal for any movie-going bird. You're no bird, eh? Then what brings you to Dead Bird Studio? Before you answer, you should watch DJ Groove's latest movie. It's real good, and I'm not being paid to say that. Honest. Hey! Watch where you're going, buddy. Check the sunglass machine Grooves, again. Right? DJ Grooves means a lot to us, so we gotta protect him. Don't you think of anything, yeah? I'll be watching you, buddy. Eyes on you. Nice. There we are. Don't tell anyone this, but before DJ Grooves became fascinated by movies, he actually ran a nightclub. I know. Crazy, right? Who would have thought? <laughs> We're gonna check this again. Oh, for. Oh. Oh dear. But I am wearing two pairs of sunglasses, so that was worth it. Anything else to look at, I don't know what it would be. That's up there on the screen. I imagine we're going to be racking up even more damages. Yeah. Let's 
dark in here. I can't tell where anything is. Okay. So we are in full on solid snake mode here. Let's make this movie happen. I will in position. Action. Mustache girl. I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dummy thick. And the clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the owls. getting yarn, but I'm not getting any new hats. I would really like some very helpful hats. I wonder, now that I think about it, though. Oh, I just noticed we're doing something adorable. We got a finger gun. Is that... Am I right? Are, do we, are we... Are we pretending to be a spy here? Or was it always like that and I just didn't notice until just now? I cannot tell if it's safe to go down. Totally not safe to go down. All right. doesn't have any effects. Uh, consider me a little bit confused, I guess. Oops. the wrong button. Pipe. There's a pipe up here or somewhere else that I didn't see. Beneath the owls. Oh! How did I not see that? Alright. That's a short window. <laughs> now, if I want the glowy, can't get through it from there.
ice yarn. That sounds very important, actually. I don't have enough, though. I have five. Is there a first-person mode where I could look through her eyes and look around? That would be super good. Way too much momentum. A mod? Oh, boy. I don't need a first-person mod, I just need it. Just wanna, like, kind of like in other games, where you can just maybe look through their eyes and look around a little bit nicer than what they give me to work with here. See the glow through the dang wall. <laughs> How far does that go? Yeah, I saw it. I'm just trying to look at this stuff instead. trying really hard to not have the sprint hat by now. So now we need one more? That's what I'm saying, like, you would think that maybe they would have some other things by now, instead of the sprint hat, for everything. Oh! Oh, thank you very much for the subscription! Thank you, Burzmali. I was not expecting that. So we can tightrope that. Or we can go this way. Try this way first. Oh, gosh darn it! I I thought he went around in full. All right, let's look at him. Okay, so he does like a backward L. Well, uh, thank you. I do appreciate it. Now you get to use the best emote on Twitch. Huh. 
trying to figure out the best timing here. that. This doesn't seem right. I think I did something. comes to worse. So this doesn't look like a way that I can go anywhere from there. going up this way. We are. Now we have enough to make that other hat. Gotcha. Ground pounds. All right. So we could go back to the Mafia town and hit those springboards or trap doors or whatever. I also think there's one in in our base. Worth trying. We're seeing what that was. But I guess we're not going any more up that way to find more stuff. I do have these. my best interest to use the spring hat for this. And the camera will not let me do anything at the moment. I want to look over, turn, like that. Try to see where I'm supposed to go. Is this going? Am I passing through their line of sight? Let's go. Action. <laughs> 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 Cactus. 
cactus. No? Well, let me... Well, let me do nothing to the cactus. Oh, whoa. whoops. Trying to, there we go. Don't want to like run off the edge. I want to just slightly drop down. So I gotta get through this section here. And now let's just not be able to see anything. Those things make me nervous, bouncing on things like that, because I'm always worried I'm going to overshoot them. Magnificent. Stunning. This trophy is everything I desire on the shelf in my living room. Of course, this big trophy is just a plastic replica. The actual trophy is really tiny. Ooh. Oh my, oh my, what is that I see? Is it true inner beauty? An innocent soul with a heart of gold? Sure. Oh no, it's just a little girl. Hello. <laughs> oh wait, you're not a penguin. Oh, that's good. I could use some non-penguin company around here, as all my penguins are frankly terrible actors. Here's the biz. I need your help. I'm on a terrible losing streak, and I just have to win this next annual Bird Movie Award. There's no doubt I absolutely must have you as the star. Here, let me take care of this. Ooh, yay. We need to give you a bird passport, darling. Step right over here. The most important part of a passport is the picture, darling. You have to look flashy and stunning. Step right over here. Let's take the pic. Okay, put on a smile and stand still, please. Don't move. But you can't see my eyes. How is that going to work as a passport? Don't I got to take my sunglasses off? Oops. Let's see how the picture turned out. <laughs> oh! Darling, you moved! The picture is ruined! How could you? We've got to fix this ugly mugshot up with some old-fashioned photo doctoring. Here, take these markers and turn yourself into the most stylish, fashionable young lady. Oh my god. You can't do this to me, game. You don't know me. Oh, 
how much effort should I actually spend on this? I'm not gonna get like precision on the, on the controller. I, 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 I'm put on the spot here, man. I don't know what I want to do. I was thinking, what if I drew on her to make her look like a penguin? I don't think I'm going to get any, like, actual decent anything to happen here. Well, we're not going to be spending an hour on this. We're actually going to be wrapping up pretty soon. Here, we'll make her into a movie star. No? Wait. Why are you like this game? Why can't I just put a dot? It won't let me... There. And... Slide this picture into your passport, and here you go. One passport for you. <laughs> wonderful, darling. Oh, just wonderful. Meet me at the movie set tomorrow, and we'll make you a star. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You can't just jump in and fiddle with the annual Bard Movie Awards. That's fraud! Fraud! Hey, everyone! We've got a fraudster over here! Oh. Where are my owl guards at? Oh, why are the owls so darn useless? Uh. All right, listen here, lass. You're in big trouble. If you're helping crooked DJ Grooves rig the awards, and I can't take you to jail, then you're got to help me even the score. That's right. You're got to be the star of my movies, too. It does that allow you to practice bird law? Oh. Sustained... Objection. Here, hold our newest prop. Practice showing it off and bring it to my movie set I, I'd tomorrow. have to ask You're Charlie for sure. Don't be late. Now we got seven, so that should open up another area, right? And then we can just take a little peek. See at that, we can go ahead and use our rift token. And switch to our ice hat. So what do we got in here? Lots and lots of letters. Nothing being sorted. I have no idea. 
idea what to do in this room. If there's anything to actually do in this room, I don't... I don't know what it would be. We'll just go ahead and leave. Oh, I need three. Found the Roomba. I don't know if I am or not. What are you doing? But I can get. It's like it's sucking up gems as it's going around. That's cute. I think I got all there is to get out of it though. Yeah, I don't see anything for ground pounding it. Back in here. Going over here. Ah, So can I go back to earlier days or anything, or is this just... Yeah. Alright. Well, we found ourselves a little secret area. I'm concerned about an open flame in what is essentially a blanket fort. I think that's gonna do it for tonight nice little stopping point there we got a little bit of the ways um seven out of 40 time pieces right I think it was 40 maybe there'll be more in the future I don't know but that's not too bad for a start I do really love the look of this game the music the lot of character to this game. The only thing that is annoying to me is the camera. Hopefully it'll be something I get more used to. And it won't be bugging me once I get more of a feel for how it works. Like, I'm not... I'm hopefully not going to get screwed over by it in the future or something like that. You know what? Let me see what we've got here. Oh, co-op. Let's go to the main menu. This is what I'm seeing on the main menu. Oh, 
all right, you're just gonna advertise all this stuff to me all of a sudden, which d didn't happen before, but that will. So we've got this showing up like that. All right, I apparently do not have it, but I would not object to getting it in the future or anything like that. But I think we're a little bit way, a little, little ways away from worrying about that. For right now, I'm just gonna worry about trying to get through the main game here. 18% in one, one night's not too bad, I think. But that's gonna do it. We will be returning to Dark Souls 3 probably on the next stream. I just wanted a little bit of a break from it, and there may be more breaks like that in the future. Because I also really like this game, and I want to play this game too. But certain times I might just say, you know what, I haven't done enough off stream to, to stream the game again. Because I like to grind off stream, find things that I might have missed, build myself up so I can keep that forward momentum. And if I don't, if I don't do an adequate amount of that between streams, then I feel like I'm just going to hit a wall and things will get bad as a result of that. So that's going to do it for tonight here. Let me see who's on. Twin Princes? I don't know. I'm going into the game blind, so I don't know anything about anything like that. I'm I'm up to the area with the crabs. So just oh, you know what? Not that they really need my attention at all with the uh, small viewership, but Spike Vegeta is actually streaming Dark Souls 2. You remember that game. So maybe I'll just send you over... Actually... Okay, so I'll tell you, Spike Vegeta is currently doing Dark Souls 2, a blind playthrough of that. So let me put his name up, and I'll actually direct you to somebody else instead. For a little bit of a raid, okay? So you can decide if you want to go check him out, or if you want to go to wherever I am upsetting you. <laughs> um, I think maybe send you back over to Luali. Again, she's playing Choice Chamber. I don't know exactly what that is, but it looks cute. And she has a bunny. And bunnies always win out, so... <laughs> you guys, hopefully you'll enjoy that. And hopefully I'll see you guys again next time. Okay? Okay. Love ya. Bye-bye.